Hello and welcome to Nether Survival! In the last episode, if you did not watch it, we found a load of ancient debris. In fact, enough so that we can get our full armor and tools upgraded to netherite, which is absolutely amazing. But, uh, I have way less diamonds than we have netherite. So, that is something that we're gonna fix in this episode. I have no idea if we will get all of the diamonds that we need, but we will see. We will see what happens. Anyways, uh, as you may notice, I am not at my base, but you've probably already seen that there's a fortress right behind me. Yes, I traveled and uh, <laughs> here is a fortress and we are going to loot it. I am indeed running the new snapshot 20w21a, um, but now there's a bunch of new cool stuff. Even new world generation type, I believe. I'm, I'm not sure. But anyways, uh, nothing too specific to our uh, scenario and situation. So we're just gonna go ahead and raid this place. It looks pretty big. Uh, but again, I, I don't know if we will have any diamonds here. Let's hope we will. Let's take a look at my inventory. I have some spare pants because... Uh, let's just turn that off. Uh, I have some spare pants because uh, my current ones are... A about to break. I have two fire resistance potions. Okay, that's about right there. The number, you see the number over there? At the left of, at the right of the box? Yeah, that, that's interesting. Uh, but yeah, I have some uh, leggings here. I have an ender chest with me. I made a new one just in case we get a bunch of stuff that we want to store uh, and can't have in our tiny inventory. Of course, I have a bunch of stone pickaxes, which, okay, to be completely honest with you, I probably don't need all of these, but you never know. And hey, we never know if we're gonna come across a bastion or something, so uh, we uh, we have a harbor. All right, well let's uh, let's take a look at this place, shall we? How do we get inside? I see an opening right there. I also see death right below me. Uh, we're not gonna find a chest on these open uh, open bridges here, so I think we may just uh, do this. Yep, I think that is uh, gonna do it. So I'm going to since we have done this plenty of times before. Okay, so this leads just out. Since we've done this plenty of times before, I think I'm gonna pass it, and uh, I'll be right back uh, once I find a lootable chest. I don't like this fortress, so it's, it looks big, which means I can probably... Uh, I'm, I'm actually going to use the trick here. Someone pointed that out as well. Use um, some sort of marker. So this is where we came from, right here, this hole. So I'm gonna, what did we look over here? Okay, so that's just a dead end. So this is where we came from. So I'm basically gonna use netherrack. Or you could also make like holes in the corners to see where you've been and where you went and where the original starting point was. Um, so I'm gonna do some of that and I'm gonna loot, or not gonna loot, I'm gonna search through this and I will be back once I find something lootable. That that way, <laughs> we can also loot multiple. Okay, we have two chests here. That's a good beginning, and we have a dead end. All right, open. Ah, oh. okay. Uh, hmm, sure. Why not? And yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna take the chest as well. You never know. What do we have here? And you know, I I really want I really really want diamonds. <laughs> I only have seven at home. I really really we really really need diamonds as in badly let, let me do the math hold on so we already have a diamond pickaxe so we need three for an axe one for a shovel two for a sword so that is already six diamonds so that is six and then we need 24 for a full set of armor so that is six plus 24 so that's 30 and we already have seven so we need 23 diamonds in total yeah that that's gonna be interesting chest hole <laughs> okay I, I don't know if that made any sense no oh. Okay, well we're getting we're getting some stuff, I guess, right, right, maybe, right. Well, gonna keep looking. Also, we may have piglins in the area, so we should be careful of that with opening chests and such. Uh, just a heads up if you're looting uh, another fortress as well. I just saw a piglin over there, so just make sure that the that the path or the the area is clear before opening one of those, as as, as I as I just said. Um. Ooh, diamond! Yes, diamond. 
perfect. Hopefully that little guy didn't see anything. I'm not sure if the small guys will actually do anything or if they will spread the word or something. Hmm. I guess, I guess the hopper is useful in this scenario. Yeah, I'm not opening it. Ooh, diamond, yes. Okay, so that's two. That's already two diamonds down. Okay, you know what? I'm still looking. I'm... Will they get angry if I... Oh, no. Yes, they do. Okay. They get angry if you even break the chest. Okay. So it's only using the hopper that is actually effective. Breaking the chest will may also make them angry. Okay. Uh, well, there's a lesson to be learned here. <laughs> <laughs> Give me my hopper. Uh, oh dear, I'm already running into invent inventory space. This this is this is not ideal. All right, found another one. Ah, nothing. Okay, I am going to pick up the armor and such, but I could also. Someone did suggest to me that I could be carrying around with me a um, a furnace to smelt down like the horse armor and the swords and such. But to be honest with you, it's pretty easy I feel like to get gold now so I'm just gonna do that <laughs> to be completely honest because yeah I, I just don't really need it we, we can go mining for it and it's kind of easy to get so yeah I think I'm just gonna do that all right well that is this wing of the fortress or the inside of the fortress uh, on this wing I believe fully um, yeah, I've been all those ways fully uh, fully explored so yeah, I think we've been here as well yeah because we were over there so I think I'm just gonna hit over there just to in that direction just to see if we have something something interesting it doesn't seem like there's spawned any natural places all those have been from spawners <laughs> don't burn me please so yeah that's that's actually pretty interesting also, no wither skeletons. It's actually very quiet around here. Maybe a bit too quiet. All right, I think we have gotten everything that this fortress has to offer in the form of uh, chests and such. So I'm now going to head over to another one that I have found. Uh, it's quite far from here. Well, not too far. All right, progress update. I just found striders with mini striders riding on top of the big striders. Also, I'm behind a pretty cool lava waterfall. Just, uh, just don't, don't take a wrong step here. Well, that, that's both cute and also pretty cool. All right, I'm, I'm gonna continue my journey here. I'm gonna find a way up, uh, up this cliffside. All right, found it. That was, um, that, yeah, in interesting, uh, interesting journey. Mainly here at the end with uh, these, these hoglins here. But let's get up here uh there we go oh dear can i yeah i can i can mine through that but yeah i'm uh, this is gonna be the same procedure as before i'm going to explore it and i'll be back if something interesting happens or we stumble across what we're here for which is chests and primarily chests with diamonds hey guys hey guys hey guys oh come on ha you're stuck take that. Eh. 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 Come on. That's one. There we go. That's two. Away with those stone bones. Okay, but I'm gonna be back uh, if I find something interesting, so stay tuned. Well, that is if I can find the entrance to the actual inside of this thing. Oh, that's a blaze spawner. No, thank you. No, oh, that's another blaze spawner. Uh, yeah, I need, I need to find the inside of this thing first. Uh... Oh, dead end. Ah. All right, it did actually have an inside. I was starting to worry that it wasn't gonna have one. So here we go. I found a chest, but I also found something else. Ow, 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 mean. Please stop existing. Okay, let's see what this has. Ugh. Really? 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 This place has a lot of these guys. As in ow, as in a lot of them. Uh, the other fortress didn't have anything, not even blazes. This thing has everything from 
places to skeletons and everything. Uh, oh, chest. Oh, another chest. <laughs> okay. Nothing again. Seriously? It's gonna be one of these hunts, isn't it? Nope. Nothing in here. Alright. And there goes my axe. Gonna keep searching. Um, that's a dead end anyway, right? Right. Yeah, have fun, guys. <laughs> nope. Oh, dear. Ow, that actually hit me. Wow. And I saw a sword poking there. Okay. Okay. I see how this is. I see how this is. Crossbow to the rescue. Really nice with these spectral arrows as well. You can actually see where your enemy is hiding at. That's really, really cool. Let's take out these blazes real quick. Get out of here. Alright. You too. Okay. And I know. Ah, there you are. You're not on the other side. Eh. Wait, there is another one up there. Why are there so many here? I don't get this. Dead end. He's up there. That was over here, right? Nope, there's a chest. Okay, sweet. But I don't want any enemies behind me. Come on. Die, please. Die. Thank you. I mean, I won't mind getting maybe an extra with a head. With a skull. That would be pretty cool. But... <laughs> Uh, I don't <sighs> wither effect. Really dislike it because that's the that's the one poison in the game that can actually kill you. Are you kidding me? Another one? Eh. Wow. And of course, of course, no diamond, no diamond. Why not? All right, another chest. It watch this fortress, the most fortified one. The one that was the hardest to find as well is going to be the one that has the least or no diamonds. And the one that is, has like zero things in it is going to have like... Yeah. Oh, okay. Never mind then. A diamond. <laughs> Alright, we're 20 down. We're, well, we're 3 down. We're missing 20. Oh. Hey, bud. Ah! Behind attack! I don't know what it's called, but I don't want part of it. Uh, these places are stressful. Die. I th I think I I think I think I hear. I hear so many. I want out. I, I just want to get out of here. I really, really don't want to stay down here. Oh, come on. Alright. Gotta get through it. I'll fight my way through if I have to. And my exit has been completely blocked. As in... Oh no, if I, if I hit them with a sword... Yep, yep, my exit has been completely blocked. Uh... Oh no. Okay, now this is just ridiculous. There's like four with the skeletons right here, where I just were. So I'm now trapped. And there's like four, two blazes down there. That's... That's not fair. That's... Not fair, and there aren't... Could you move back, please? And there aren't even more than one diamond here. Like, this is... This is ridiculous. Finally. Eesh. This might become a longer episode than I had expected. <laughs> we might have to do a two or three part. Look at those! And look at that! And look at that! No, uh, and look at that up there! Uh, please tell me. That I'm almost done with ow this place. The thing is, I can't trust my back. Like, 
I can't trust it that there's nothing behind me. Uh, I hope this is entertaining for you guys. <laughs> oh dear. This is just gonna I'm just gonna get some blocks here that I can use for our placeholders. Man, I hear skeletons everywhere. Like I hear them. Well, there's a chest. Please let there be two diamonds in there, at least. At least. Peekaboo! Come on. You there. Come on. Let's fight. Let's fight. There we go. Okay. <sighs> Nothing. Nothing. Alright, well now I have pretty much, I think... Now, look at the... Uh, uh. Look at how many. Nope. Oh no. I'm so dead. I'm 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 dead. No, wait. 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 I'm not dead. I'm not dead. Oh. My. Okay. 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 Nah, mate. <laughs> nah. This place is quite possibly the creepiest, the deadliest, and the most. Well, yeah, I can't really see say much else. Uh? Yeah. If you need with the skeleton skulls, this is certainly the place to, to go. That I'm creeped out. I can hear skeletons everywhere. I'm being attacked everywhere. I was down to one and a half hearts. Are you kidding me? Uh, I just want to get out of here. Okay. I, I think I'm done with this fortress. Uh, not because I'm tired of it. I, I mean, I'm kind of tired of it that. Are you? Are you? Bruh. You serious? Yeah, I think I'm done with this fortress. I'm gonna move on to the next one. <laughs> uh, yep, yeah, I'll see you guys at the um, at the next fortress on the list, alright? Yeah, I think, um, think that, yeah. Yeah, I'll see you in a bit. But you look at that, they have even placed guards on the perimeter, so if I ran that way, I would m I would get stopped. <sighs> I just found a ruined portal, I think. Because, um, that's inter- Oh, there's lava right under us. Okay. Yeah, that's, that's a ruined portal. Um... At least one of these gravel thingy things, where when you mine it, it all collapses. No, it doesn't look like it. Alright, well, let's... Uh, I'm gonna excavate this a little bit. To uh, to see... Yep, that's the chest. There's the chest. Alright, it does not seem like we have any gold blocks here. Maybe I just haven't excavated enough? I don't know. Ow. Let's open this chest. Uh, we should be good. Ooh. Okay. Uh... Let's take a look at this. Uh, we have Golden Leg X, Curse of Binding. Curse of Binding, okay, that's interesting. Uh, we got Fire Aspect Sword. And an Unbreaking 3 Sword. Ooh. Well, that's interesting. I'm gonna keep those, just in case we are able to do something. Just in case. And I don't have my Diamond Pickaxe, so I can't, I can't get that. Oh dear. Uh, eh, go away. Uh, that is just normal blackstone, right? Yeah, that's just normal blackstone generated naturally, I believe. All right, well, I continue in my journey. That was a cool little little uh, discovery, though. Oh no! Also, my also my shield is gone. Actually, I can make a new one with iron ingot, which would save me some inventory space. So I'm gonna do that right away. I need a new one anyway, so might as well use it to make it and save an inventory slot. Oh, gas. Okay. Yep. I'm gonna continue. Uh, be right back. Okay. Um, I just stumbled upon a uh, bastion remnant. 
That is a Bastion Remnant, right? Hey, I remember the name, by the way. <laughs> uh, but yeah, that, that, that sure looks like a Bastion Remnant. I mean, I believe... Let me look that up real quick, actually. I believe you can actually get diamond tools and armor in Bastion Remnants. Even enchanted, I think. Not 100% sure. I think you can. Let me see what you can actually find. And oh my, that's a lot of gold blocks. We're definitely stopping here for a bit. Ooh, that's it. Don't you dare break any of this stuff. Yeah, that's what I thought. Be gone. Yeah, let me look up what what uh, tools and armor you can actually find here. Hold on. All right, you are... Come on. Okay, you are able to find diamond, I believe, diamonds and some diamond stuff down here. I, I don't know if you will be able to find... Like all the different diamond tools and such, but you should be able to find at least diamond armor, at least damaged diamond armor, that is. Uh, so that's cool. So I think we should definitely check this place out. Now, where is that pillar? Uh, move aside, please. Move, move aside, thank you. Uh, yeah, that's a lot of gold blocks up there. I just don't have an iron pickaxe with me, so I might have to wait and see. But anyways, let's take a look around here, shall we? Uh, I think I'm gonna search... Oh, hello. I think I'm gonna search most of this off camera. And I'll be back, just like the fortresses, if I find something interesting, treasure and such. So I'll be right back. I don't trust you. I'll be right back if I find something interesting. Alright, I did find a treasure here. Not a treasure. Yeah, a chest. Treasure. Chest. Chest treasure. I don't know. Uh, not breaking it. Not gonna open it. We're gonna take. And, well, I'm gonna throw some stuff out of here. Uh, don't need to flint. Alright, yeah. Let's take the hopper and place it there. And let's see. <gasps> a lodestone. You can actually get a lodestone from here. That is great, because I was not able to make these, because it required some ingredient from the old world that I was not able to get. That is amazing. Lodestone. That is cool. That's amazing. Basically, a lodestone is... Oh, wait a second. Uh, I don't have a compass down here. And I can't get redstone. Ah. Big oof. Basically, a lodestone, you can use a compass on the lodestone and the compass will will point to the location of the lodestone that you have placed. Only issue that I just realized now is that um, I don't have a compass. And I don't have a way of getting a compass. Because um, it requires redstone. And I can't get redstone down here. So that is quite sad, to be honest. All right, down here now. Just gonna start the recording again, just in case something uh, happens, since there's quite a lot of lava around here. Oh wait, that's where I came from. Uh, is this really it? There might not be anything else. Ow, ow. Uh, I don't want the crossbow, it has been vanishing. Yeah, I th don't think... Wait, I see that up there. Yep, there are indeed treasure here. Again, I do not have an iron pickaxe, so I will have to mark this place with some uh, screenshots of some coordinates here. Same with... Uh, with that over there, because I don't have an iron pickaxe and I can't really make one. Uh, I think that is pretty much what this uh, Bastion Remnant has to offer, unfortunately. Does not seem like there's any more to it. Wish there were, but it doesn't seem like it. Anyways, I'm going to then continue my journey. And again, I'll be back. That is a lot of gold, though. I definitely want that. Is there anything inside of that? No. Alright. Could be. Could have been. Anyways, I'll be back once again. Okay, I got those. I